An official Chinese media report on Sunday unveiled the moment when a YJ-20 hypersonic anti-ship missile was launched from a Type 55 large destroyer of the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy. Experts said that the maneuverable hypersonic missile can hit targets from an almost vertical angle, making it very difficult to intercept. The footage was released on Sunday by China Military Bugle, an official media account under the PLA News Media Center. It shows the finalization test of a ship-to-ship -ship missile on board the 10,000-ton class large destroyer, Wuxi. A finalization test is a term often used to describe a final test of a weapon system before it wraps up its design phase and enters production. Multiple camera angles provided up-close views of the test launch. According to the footage, a YJ-20 hypersonic missile was launched from one of the vertical launching system cells located in the aft section of the Type 055 large destroyer Wuxi. The missile used a cold launch method as it was ejected out of the VLS cell before igniting its engine. The missile hit and destroyed its target, according to the China Military Bugle report. This is the first time an official media report has shown a live YJ-20 hypersonic anti-ship missile being fired from a warship. The YJ-20 Wee was officially unveiled at China's V-Day military parade held in Beijing on September 3rd, alongside with three other types of anti-ship missiles, namely the YJ-15 missile, the YJ-19 hypersonic missile, and the YJ-17 hypersonic missile. According to official media, they can be carried by multiple launch platforms, including carrier-based fighter jets, surface vessels, and submarines. Maneuverable missiles that can exceed Mach 5 or five times the speed of sound are considered hypersonic missiles, said Chinese military affairs expert Zhang Junshen. He told the Global Times that based on the appearance of the YJ-20, it is a boost glide missile consisting of a rocket booster and a bicone glide vehicle. The bicone can form shock waves during hypersonic flight, which enables the missile's air rudders to perform maneuvers during the missile's terminal flight, uh, boosting its defense penetration capabilities.